His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. the Baron's permission. Thing is, he ain't here. Not about to ask for anything. I'm telling you, you can try to stop me. But that'd be an error. A mortal one. Think you got me shaking in my boots? You sure as hell should be. Fine. Cripple's not worth no blood. See the groom. He ought to be glad to give him up. Bugger's been eating from the feed bags. And a pleasant journey to you both. Thank you kindly. <laughs> I'm taking Uma. There ain't a... Sergeant Hartle said I could. Bring him back, though, won't you? Be awful dull without him. No. Not about to bring him back. Open the door. Now. Hey, little guy. This here's Roach. She'll take us to Care Morton. Well, come on. displeased with you. Then he ought to ask somebody else for help. The Emperor does not ask anyone for anything. You will ride with us to Vitsima. Sure about that? Don't even try. Fine. Lead the way. And the third army will sweep in from the west to take Bangli. If I may, your Imperial Majesty, our spies report that the garrison at Banglin consists almost wholly of mercenaries. Bribery, then. We stand to lose exactly no men in battle. And we stand to lose less time. Very well. Give the orders. Then set sail. As you wish. At once!
Your Imperial Majesty, Yennefer. I did not have you brought here for an exchange of courtesies. Report. No courtesies needed? Perfect. But remember, I'm not your soldier, or page, or dog, so don't give me any orders. Would you prefer I order my guards? Look around. I need only beckon. Geralt. Now report. Siri. Well, this man is the key to finding her. I give you three solid leads. Trails as fresh as morning dew. The aid of my spies and my court sorcerers. Yet in my daughter's stead, you bring me this... monstrosity? I hope you have more to say. For your sake. Listen. I'm looking for a needle in a haystack. A needle that at any moment can... It's a difficult task. I know this. What of it? Listen to me. I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. I wage a war against the North, command men in tens of thousands, while at home the trade corporations and nobles seek to depose me. You cannot expect me to pity you the difficulty of your task. I pursued those leads you gave me. Siri first reappeared in Skellige with a mage, an elf. Yen knows more. The Wild Hunt tracked them down, found them there. They were forced to flee to Velen. Where they were separated. Siri spent some time with a local warlord, a self-styled baron who... Yes, yes, I know my vassals. Who helped her get to Novigrad, where Siri crossed some of the city's underworld bosses. She had to flee, went back to Skellige, ran into her elf companion there. And into the Wild Hunt, again. Siri and the elf fled, out to sea this time. Their boat returned to shore the next day, with only him on board. Hmm. The information appears of little use, though at least it seems you kept busy. This monstrosity might well be your daughter. Its body is the product of a curse someone hides inside it. Can you lift this curse? I've done a great deal of research, made inquiries, but to lift it I would need to know the words used to cast it, and that... Raphael Ellen, Kedmel Foli, Gladiv Dorn Eptened, Bandro Ithne Iacus. Dandelion told me. Siri talked to him about it. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Lady Yennefer, my question stands. Yes. I, I believe I can. But I must... The details do not interest me. Geralt, you've achieved precious little, yet admittedly more than the bumblers in my spy corps have. I give you half the promised reward. You will receive the other when you bring me Siri. Fine. This audience is over. Till the next... So, how do we lift Uma's curse? We must take him to Kaer Morhen. Oh, and Geralt. Forgive me, but I'm unable to teleport you, Uma, and Roach, so... Don't worry, we'll ride there. Never did like teleporting. Take care of yourself. Wait. Here, probably better if you keep it. Of course. I'm off. His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Geralt needed to lift the curse, so he took Uma to the home of the world's greatest specialists on dark spells, to the Witcher's Fortress of Kaer Morhen.
Fork Tales this close to the fortress? Someone's been slacking off. journey how was it calm if you don't count the forked tail that flew over our heads a few miles back passenger got a little restless <laughs> mm. what have we here multiple deformities eyes ears nostrils a hair lip and is this <laughs> now now calm down and if it was right on one count thing sure isn't pretty Yen's here already. And how? <laughs> you two argue? Geralt, I understand she's a... Well, how do I put this? Emancipated, strong-willed woman. But do manners count for nothing? She teleports in, not even a nice-to-see you, jumps right into a... We've a curse to live, there's this to do and that. So Eskel and Lambert get going. And she went to the guest room to rearrange things through the bed off the balcony. So where is everyone? Eskel's hunting fork tails. Gotta nip that infestation in the bud. And since Yennefer needs to distill some ingredients from their organs, well, like they say, two birds, one stone. Lambert's still in the keep. Preparing to venture into the mountains to enrich the phylactery with elemental power. Mm -hmm. And Yen? Assembling a megascope. Wanted my help running around with some chirping contraption, searching for something. But I'm too old for that nonsense. I should let her know I'm here. If you say so, but don't go thinking she'll throw her arms around your neck. this? Brewing potions? No. Booze from potato peels. Hmm. For my welcome back feast? Actually, more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the Circle's no walk in the park, in more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous white wolf at my side. So, you ready? Gotta take care of something. Wait for me. Sure.
Everything's ready at my end. No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, meant to tell you. Can't get to the circle through the mountains. Rockslide blocked the pass last spring. So we approach from the pond side, like when we did the trial of the medallion? Exactly. Remember the way? Not easily forgotten that. He who returns with his medallion will prove himself worthy and may set off on the path. Vesemir ever hear you impersonate him? <laughs> yeah. Old man can't stand it. Savola's Breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. It doesn't bother me, though. Not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those salamander assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. Been thinking. Are you gonna swim across the pond? No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow. Never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in and scoop up whatever floats to the surface. <laughs> that makes sense. from this old master down in Zarakin. Save that tale for your next sorceress. Tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? Seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too often. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. Damn it! I moored it right here, I swear! Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Mm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. human.
Last thing we needed. Cave entrance is just opposite, see it? Gotta sail across the pond, go through the cave, climb Troll's head, and we're there. Doesn't seem like such an ordeal now, does it? No. Still gives me the shivers, though. You know only two boys returned from my group? You were the ones who ran into old spear tip in the caverns, right? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Jump in the boat. All right. I'm taking the tiller, though. Because? Because it's my boat, not up for discussion. Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. Barely see the tip of my nose. Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Wanna hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad. Fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Ready for the caverns? Almost. Before we go inside... Ugh, drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, step softly or you'll wake old spear tip? Old spear tip still down there? Yeah, he is. Unless he's done us a favor and killed over on his own. Could come at us at any moment. How'd the rhyme go? Old spear tip's a deep sleeper. Wake him up and you'll sleep deeper. Come on. Help! Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. It's gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? Help! Help! <sighs> Whatever you want to do. You're probably right. Let's go straight to the cave. Finally, something reasonable. <laughs> Bones. Pulverized. Mm-hmm. Old spear tip's never been kind to guests. Not if I give you a boost. Remember? Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Oh! You fat fuck! One. 
two, three. You're no feather either. Come on, let's go. Maybe? Mm -hmm. And wake old spirit stomping like that. Relax. I slipped. We need to be quiet. I could do without a warm welcome from old spear tip. Something tells me he's not gonna like this. Something fell in my eye. Splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That'd make you even nastier. Ha ha. Hear that? Mm -hmm. Old spear tips looking for us already. Ugh. Place reeks of mold. What did you expect? Scent of violets? Would have been nice. Just lost the element of surprise. Couldn't care less. I'm up for the challenge. You miss me, whore son? Voltaire, you whore son. <laughs> Voltaire, who's that? Don't remember? Little guy, a scar on his chin right here. Oh, yeah, I remember. All we can do now. Never made it out of here. Let's go.
Oh, good to be back above ground. Mm-hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. Don't know who you're trying to impress. Tough guy stuff's just not working on me. <laughs> Look who's talking. Vesemir told me about that job you did for those Nilf guardians in Velen. What? What are you doing? Killing monsters. <laughs> Good one. Just came out that way. Come on. See him shit and run soon as he saw us? Mm hmm. Never known a troll to do that. Slow now, whoa. Uh, which us is to walk no more. Uh, Stop. Uh, East Mountain, Trolley Mountain. Trolley Mountain. Huh? Oh. Uh, hi! This. Troll Mountain! Uh, you talk to these idiots. Stay calm. We just want to get to the circle. Which is this thing one say, thing two do, thing three do, sometime. Ah, uh, enough! Out of my way, dimwits, or I'll grind you to gravel. Understand? <laughs> Mm-hmm, they understood all right. Congrats. Run for the cave! Before they stone us to death! Faster. Far more! Which is his understanding? We understand it, but we still gotta get to the Circle of Elements. Listen, but we. Charles come know to which is a castle. Rock Slotfner. Pretty rock. Enjoying this little chat? Cause, uh, it's not getting us anywhere. I'm talking. Fact is, you know as much about negotiating as they do about grammar. We're not here to hurt you. We don't want to touch your rocks. Just let us pass. Try rock throw. Witchesy strike no back. Just talky talky. Witcher, good? Only you. Witcher says monster kills trolls monsters. Yes, true is. No face, mate. Mm. Um, we do go this. Use sharp back clubs leave here. Use pass. No grease. We smash.
All right. We'll leave our swords here. Pick them up on the way back. We want to know. Nick Metal Mouse You nuts? Shut up and follow my lead. I think you might have missed your calling. Hmm? If I remember Pappy Vesemir's lessons correctly, witchers kill monsters. Well, we made it. No denying that. Damn. Beautiful view. We can soak it in later. Of course. Duty before pleasure. Remember how this circle works? Been a while since I activated my medallion here. It's fine, old man. No need to make excuses. Light the torches and place the phylactery on the altar. I'll handle the rest. How'd it go? Water, then earth, then air? Geralt? 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 in place. Then all we gotta do is wait. The container will absorb the power of the elements while we catch a breather. So, how'd you deal with the trolls when you passed the trial of the medallion? Let me think. Oh yeah, used Axie, but I only had to get past one troll. Other two were busy. Yeah, useful sign, Axie. Saved my life a short while ago. Yeah, Axie's useful. And dangerous. <laughs> what makes you say that? It tempts you to overuse it. Force a merchant to reduce his price. Make an arrogant noble drink from the gutter. Teach someone to show you respect. Can become hard to resist. I don't. Life's too short. Tell me, you always been such a cynical bastard? No. I was adorable before Vesemir brought me to care more him. Think it's that bad being a witcher? Guess I could have been someone worse. Just a shame I had no choice. It was our destiny. Destiny? Let me tell you about destiny. My dad was a drunk. He'd knock a few back, then beat me and mom bloody. We prayed for his death every night. One day our prayers were almost answered. Dad lost his way coming home from the tavern, walked smack into a nest of neckers. But some witcher saved him. Know what he wanted in return? Give me the first thing you see when you get home. My life. For the life of that prick? I say fuck that kind of destiny. Know what? Let's get out of here. Don't like what you're hearing, huh? Witchers shouldn't talk like that. Know what else you won't like? After the trial of the medallion, I rode straight home to thank my daddy for everything. Want to hear what I did to him? Lambert, please. Thought we were opening up, having an honest talk. But fine, let's continue pretending everything's just peachy. The road beckons, my good man. Our companions await. Need to get our swords. Which are with no swords like a man without an arm. Sure thing, brother. Which is this sharp back club takes and home goes. Mm-hmm. Don't worry. I don't need convincing. Come on, girl.
Right. Let's get back. After you, sir. Must be Eskel's prince. No one else has left the keep recently. 